Hello, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Shining Pearl, as we are going somewhere? Uh, it's been a few days since I've actually played this, and I mean, these will probably be pretty much back-to-back, -back, but for me personally, and I don't know, I don't have a headphone in, uh, it's been a few days since I've been able to play this. Uh, okay, so we're going to this city. Which I think we need to go back. Well, this is where... I don't trust it, man. Let's find out what happens. I hope I'm uh, going somewhat of the right way here. Uh, <laughs> or if we're going around the same level ish, which I'm assuming with Badoof we probably are, and maybe, but, uh, any Badoozle, uh, yeah, level seven, um, what was I saying? It's been a couple days since, uh, since I've played any Pokemon Shining Pearl, because I've been busy, so I'm a little bit out of the loop here of what's, uh, what's going on, but we're gonna venture forward and see what happens. My dad gave me some Pokemon. They're gonna win for me. Whatever you say, youngster Tyler. Magikarp. <laughs> water, water is weak to grass. Yeah. I was like, I always get those ones confused. There's a couple of them where I'm like, Ooh, it's either vice, it's either this way or vice versa. And now another magic herb. Your dad hates you if he's just like, here's some magic herbs. Yes, let's give Zappard a wingo here. I don't know what face I'm trying to make. Zappard, let's do it. So bad because like we're like way overpowered compared to them. And Starly's dead. <laughs> Your dad hates you. He gave you shitty Pokemon. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna venture a little bit more into this today. I wonder what's over here. Anything good? And yeah, Badoof. Like if we're just gonna run into Badoofs and stuff, I'm just gonna <clears throat> excuse me. Uh, probably try to kill it and bail. Actually, why don't we go since we're low on like EPs? Um, I know this drug. Let's go heal our Pokemon. So we all have fresh stats for everything. Because, like, we're not far away from a Pookie Center either, you know what I mean? Hello. I would like to rest my Pokemans, please. I'm actually going to switch Turtwig out just so we can play something different for a little while. Since we've been playing with uh, Turtwig a bunch. Um, just to try out something else. Like, what are your... Play with Machop a little bit. I really like Machop. I'm not gonna lie though, like, I have a feeling this is gonna be a super long Let's Play <laughs> series. Last Samantha. Badoo. Alright. Uh, we're not very effective, though. So. Pokemon.
Let's do a swappy swap real quick. The little mod chop is not uh, not very effective against the dudes. Now we have Wingo. Oh, Wingo's got Intimidate. Nice. I did not know that. One shot. Good job, Wingo. Every time I say his name, I gotta say it like that, too. Oh. I thought you had more than one Pokemans. You're right, I'm strong. Oh. Running into something. What are we running into? A little Shinx. I always want to call it Spinx, and I know that's not right. Dwayne. Get in there, Dwayne. Oh. The kid not want to do anything? Hey, you. You want to fight us? Uh, well, if we're going to be going into a cave, wouldn't it make more sense to have Shelly? No. Oh. Hold on. What am I doing? Move the Pokemon. I'm not crazy on the Pokemon moving. It's kind of weird to... Maybe I'm just dumb. That's a actually a, a very plausible case. Yeah, I don't remember teaching that to Bidoof. I thought we taught it to Geodude. got two. I don't know, but do. Do, do, be, do, be doing. <laughs> yeah, I didn't think so. Let's go, Wingo. Quit using that worry seed and giving my bird insomnia. It's not very nice. What you get? Oh no, it poisoned my wingo! think wing attack is still super effective I'm gonna say yes <laughs> very effective well someone would even say it's super yeah I'm sure you probably know a stupid move crunchy like growl I don't think I've used Crunchy once so far. <gasps> Ooh! Zeppard's evolving. Nice. Zappert evolving into a Luxio. And I think it's got a third... 
a third evolution, doesn't it? <laughs> I think it does. I'm actually curious to see what Pokemon we run into. I'm hardly you know. not that interested. <laughs> I mean, it's level 8. Oh, you're a bug guy. I should have known. Bug catcher Brandon. Kick her a top. Let's go, Shelly. Um... I didn't see what level that thing was. What, probably like six or seven? Roll out. I was only hit once. I thought roll out can hit multiple times. Okay, now you're just stuck in it for multiple times. We send it out now. Wormpool, let's keep. Go back on the rollout plan. I guess we're still on the rollout plan. <laughs> I'm actually going to look. Go to my bag here. Antidote. Let's just go ahead and give you two while we're at it. Alright, now we can go face these two. Play with us. <laughs> New parachutes. These guys are like little electric guys, right? Is that what they are? They're electric guys. I think we want to switch out. I think they are. I'm not entirely sure that they are. But to be safe. Never heard of that move before, I don't think. Wait, my poor little turtwig. They level nine too. in front they're like all ganging up on my poor little Shelly here I'll oh, growl those both interesting stop it well I don't think I'm attacking that one <laughs> I think uh, Safi's got to take out the other one. Billy wants to learn Curse.
Yes, maybe? I don't know. Dwayne wants to learn wood sweep? Hell yeah. Uh... Too leer. Everybody's out here leveling up. It didn't work as well as I was hoping. <laughs> it's crazy to me they can learn the move mid battle. Maybe they're not electric. Because Roha didn't seem to do a whole lot of good. Wait, was Roll Out Rock or is it gr I I don't even remember now. Now we're in a whole different town. Like I have no idea where we're actually going. <laughs> Follow me, and you'll see that we are completely and utterly lost. I had a blast battle the other day, and my Pokemon's HP got low. I thought we were done for. But then all of a sudden, my Pokemon ate the berry it was holding. Whew. We're kind of close to Eterna City, but it's still quite far away. You should be prepared for a long journey. If you've got Pokemon with you, it's safe for even a kid like you to go off driving alone. All right, what's going on in this city? Some kinds of Pokemon appear only if they're attracted by the sweet sense of honey. Pokemon must have a cute sense of smell. They can sense the aroma of honey from very far away. I need honey, apparently. Welcome to Flormora. Low, low aroma, the town of flowers. Flowers and more flowers. You should plant some flowers of your own too. Yay for flowers. I wanted to get some flowers from Flororama Meadow. <laughs> some Team Glack guys said the outfits came off. Those Glack guys went out to the meadow past these flowers here. Do you know about Garcidia flowers? I'm, I'm butchering names. I know, I know. They're given as bouquets to express feelings of gratitude. I don't know what I'm saying. I know, I know. It takes people to watch these videos for them to call me out on how poorly I'm pronouncing stuff. Enduring tradition around these parts. Why, hello there. I see you're adventuring with Pokemon. I'm sure you're making my any lov many lovely memories together. Oh, you there. And I gather you're winning a... You've seen a wishing star before. Do you mind taking this Pokemon? I think it'd be perfect for you. Do we just get a Jirachi? What? I'm gonna call it Starflower. Add to my party. Uh, goodbye, Crunchy. You have served us well, and I will see you in the future. Neat. I got drawn here by the sweet sense of... Seriously, what's that? What am I? A Pokemon or something? Oh, neat. Simply love it here. The atmosphere is so uplifting. You can you came to get emotionally healed too, didn't you? I could use that. Uh what level are you? You're only five. What kind of Pokemon are you again? No. Stop it. Steel and Psychic. Nice. 
Grouchy's a legendary, right? I have to look it up. I was like, okay. Hold on. No, I don't think so. Is yeah, it's a legendary. I thought so. Cool. Pays off to talk to people. Not in the real world, but at least in Pokemon. Berry trees are profoundly interesting. If you grow them with care, they will bear great berries. <laughs> bear berries. They'll bear berries. Nope. If I dress up and go to the TV station in Jubilee City with my Pokemon, can everyone in the region see my Pokemon? Probably, if all TV works. You can't buy berries or ribbons at Pokemarts. Probably don't do anything. Um, we have two more buildings to go into. And then it's obviously we got to fight Team Galactic, which will probably be in the next episode. The Orma Town was a barren, desolate hill long ago. People started planting flowers on it because it was such a sad place. But nothing would grow. People didn't know what to do. And then one day, someone expressed thanks for the blessings of nature. Then the whole hill burst into bloom. Isn't that strange and wonderful? Do you think it's cute how Pokemon pluck berries? Yes, you agreed. Here's some TMs for the, the move pluck. Cool, thanks. Single berry will grow into a plant that makes several berries. By planting one, there will be more and more berries in the world. I hope you'll find. I hope you'll help us spread more berries everywhere. Thanks for the berry. Trainer, please water berries using this spray duck watering can. Cool, thanks. Not sure, where you can plant these. Hello, would you like to exchange your berries for some stickers? Okay, that's that's that, I suppose. So that being said, we have Team Galactic to come in. Where are we at in the map? We are... Okay, so we got to travel through the forest to get up there. I don't know why we couldn't just go straight up. Maybe we're not allowed yet. But anyway, when we come back, we will take on these Team Galactic dorks and move through the forest with our uh, brain spanking new legendary. So you guys be so kind uh, to press buttons and I'll see y'all later. Take it easy. Peace.